Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Monday the 8th of July 2024. I hope you are doing well, doing your best possible, living your best possible life. Um, <laughs> I uploaded the New York Times game earlier today, uh, but the video editor had cut off the last part. Um, so uh, thank you for the comments uh, noting that. I had no idea. Uh, but I have re-uploaded it now, the full game. But there was a nice comment on there from George, regular commenter on the channel, who said, uh, case withdrawn for lack of evidence. And I thought that was very funny. It, that one did make me laugh. Thank you for that comment. Unfortunately, it's gone now. That's the problem with deleting videos. You lose the comments too. Anyway, uh, that one's done. Uh, this one is the Los Angeles Times expert level puzzle. I'll be ha bashing at that in a minute. Having a bash at that in a minute, I should say. Um... I wonder, I was, a thought has crossed my mind. Um, I wonder how much fiction, fictional series, has to do with influencing those people who are very susceptible to um, conspiracy theories. I say this because I've just watched, I've just watched a series from, I think it's 11 years ago, 2013 or some uh, something like that. Some kind person has uploaded a series onto YouTube, which I think was from Channel 4 in the UK called Utopia and uh, I'd never seen it before or heard about it or anything like that and uh, it was very interesting to watch it's quite fun you know I I enjoy fiction of course um, nice very beautifully filmed and nicely directed and acted and with interesting kind of background music etc etc and twists and turns in the plot but all basically about, you know, um, conspiracy theories of vaccines and, you know, how terrible drug companies are basically doing things to, uh, you know, control the world, etc., etc. Um, and I wonder if that kind of, that's that's well before COVID. But I just wonder if any of that influenced those people who are vaccine skeptics and those people who are very uh conspiratorially minded you know those people who find connections where there are no connections and that kind of thing uh, i don't mean of course that i think all of this kind of fiction should stop it's the same thing as like video games you know their violent video games are played by the majority of people without any effect uh, but of course there are some people who are badly affected and want to go and carry out shootings in real life or something like that so so, uh, but that doesn't mean to say that you have to ban all video games for that reason. It just means some people are more susceptible to it. But I just wondered how susceptible or how influential those that kind of fiction is on people who spot things that are not there, patterns that are not there, and see things that are basically not there. <laughs> uh, of course, that doesn't mean... Uh, and of course, the point is that there there are always some elements of truth to go with these things, some bits of truth mixed in with conspiracies that's the problem is that people take a small idea and run in the wrong direction with it um, and it, of course it doesn't mean that these kind of companies have never done anything bad um, I mean look at the tobacco industry and the way that they covered up uh, the fact that they knew that smoking was causing cancer for many years and now the fossil fuel in industry is covering up has been covering up for many years the fact that uh, they have been the ones creating global warming so um, I don't mean that nothing bad is ever, you know, can ever happen, but just most of it is just such nonsense. It's just so nonsensical. All right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? We've got fives blocking across here, across here, and down here. That's going to give me a five in that square. Five going up to the top here like this. That's going to put a five in that square. I see threes blocking like this I almost burst into song there I see threes are green that's not right is it uh, and I've seen something I saw something else before while I was chatting to you I did spot something else what was the other thing I spotted I think there was something else there it is four blocking no oh 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 so it wasn't true I spotted something that was untrue there we go <laughs> never mind then forget that uh, but I can see two blocks across here, so two is in one of those two squares. So two blocks along here and five blocks along here like that. So we have a pair of two and five in those squares. So these squares can't be two or five. They must be one and seven. Is that any good? Uh, not much. Sevens then will be down here, which we could have deduced anyway. 
All right, we've got one and seven here, so anything else going on? Six then will be in these squares. Okay, sixes have to be there. So six blocks down there, six blocks down here, six across here, and six across here. I only, only needed the sixes going across, didn't need all that other stuff. Never mind, more than enough is plenty. Uh, six is going up in this direction, and six across there will give me a six here as well. Two across. Oh, maybe it was the two, it wasn't the four that I saw. It was the two I think I saw while I was chatting to you. There we are. Now I've seen it. That's better. And now we do have four blocking down, so that's going to be a four. In that square, the missing digits here are seven, eight, nine. The only thing we have over here is this nine. So these two squares are not seven, eight, nine. They have to be one and five so this can't be five that's got to be one five has to be there two and seven block across here that puts two and seven into those squares and gives me an eight here and so now we've got eight across here eight across there and eight down there so that's got to be an eight Um, I said 1 and 7 in those squares. Does that give me anything else? I'm not sure. I think I'm looking in the wrong place, the wrong part of the grid. Let me shift my eyes somewhere else. Well, is this... Am I missing one, four, seven, and eight here? There's no one. One, four, seven, eight is four numbers. There's no one, there's no four, there's no seven, there's no eight, yeah. Yes, one, four, seven, eight. And we've got one, four, and one, four, and eight in those squares. So that's got to be a seven, hasn't it? And that will be our two. Oh, I see. I could have worked it out from the twos. I just, yes, I see now. I was wondering why I couldn't quite work out what that was. Uh, all right, so what's missing up here? This is uh, seven nine, is it? Okay, seven nine there, and this is one four eight, and one and eight are together, so that's got to be our four. Aha, 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 I see something. 4 and 9 block this square. We don't have 4 and 9 in this row yet, so that's got to be 4 and 9 in those squares. And we'll give me a 6 over here. 
6 back this way, that way, here's our 6. We know this is 4 and 9, we know this is 1 and 7. Uh, so this is 2 and I worked that out before, 2, 5. And this is 1, 4, 9. And 4 and 9 are together, so that's a 1. Six blocks up here and there and across here and there. So there's our six. That's the last digit six. Okay, we've got two blocking up here and two across there, so there's our two. I'm stuck. Um, okay. Oh, okay. So three five across here, three five across here, and three and five blocking up here. So we've got a pair of 3 and 5 in those squares there. Now what? Let's look along the rest of the row. We've got 3, 5, so we're looking for 2, 7, 9. Any help on 2, 7, 9? Yes, we've got 2 blocking here, 2 blocking there, so that's our 2. And we're going to have 7, 9 in those squares. Any help on 7 or 9? No, not really. Now what about this 2, has that done anything? Yes, 2 blocking down here, 2 across there and there. It says that's a 2, 2 up here, 2 across there, there's our 2. In fact we have 5 blocking across here and here now. There's our 5, 5 going up here, 5 across and across there. It says that's a 5. And this is three, of course, right? Three across there. I did say three and five. I was just trying, forgotten what I'd said there for a moment. Three blocking down, three down there. There's our three, three across this way, down, down here. There's a three. 
uh, one I think blocking down here, one across there, there's one, oops, uh, one up here, one across there, there's our one, this will be seven I remember, seven blocks up there, there goes the seven, uh, so seven blocks that square, this must be a seven, and this will be nine, missing number here four, one number to go up the top here is it a nine I think it is nine blocking across and nine up here says this is a nine two more numbers to get here those are seven and eight so seven blocks across here here's the seven this will be eight eight blocks this way there's the eight this is a one uh, so this game is almost finished uh, but I think it's been a lot easier than the uh, New York Times today if we manage to finish it from here presuming I'm assuming that we are uh, four nine and down here oh, we've still got a little bits to do um, can we finish the ones not as they are what about the four uh, not yet seven Uh, not yet. Eight then, where are you? There we go, eight down there. And eight this way and this way. And then eight across here and there. We finish the eights. Uh, one blocks this square, so that will be a one. The last number over here is a seven and this is nine nine across here gives us nine in that square nine up here says this is a nine and nine blocking down here says that's a nine uh, here we need a four there we need a four four blocks down there's a four four blocks up there's a four this is one and this is seven and finish with the seven so yeah a much easier game uh, than the uh, New York Times today, I would suggest. Thank you, Los Angeles Times. Uh, sometimes on a Monday I do the impossible Sudoku. I actually don't have any paying work today, uh, this evening, but I don't think I'm in such a great Sudoku frame of mind, so I think I'll leave it for another day. Take care. Bye-bye.